Following channels and topics is how we can customize our news feed. A channel is a single news source, such as National Geographic, NPR, the LA Times, or CNN. A topic brings together stories from multiple sources on a single subject. Currently, I'm following two channels, National Geographic and NPR. Tap on either of these to see the latest stories from each. Some channels, like National Geographic, are broken down into sections, which are displayed across the top of the page. In the Suggested by Siri section are several more topics and channels. Tap on each of these to view the stories within them. Tap on the Add button to start following that channel or topic. Doing this is going to add the item under the Channels and Topics section. Tap the ellipsis button here to stop the topic from being suggested or to block it entirely. Blocking a topic or a channel will remove all its stories from the Today View newsfeed. You can also swipe left on a series suggestion to just ignore it. Swipe left on a channel or topic you're following to unfollow it. Tap and hold, and we're able to unfollow or block. We get these same options while viewing a channel or topic by tapping on the ellipsis button in the upper right. While scrolling through our news feed, we can choose to follow topics or channels. Long press on a story, and in the menu that pops up, we're able to go to the channel to see all the stories within it, follow the channel, or block the channel. Here on my iPad, the entertainment topic is presented. Tap the header to view all the latest stories within the topic. Tap the Add button to start following this topic, which is going to add it into the Channels and Topics section. Or we can completely block the topic or stop Siri from suggesting it. If you don't want to see any of these entertainment stories, it's best to block the topic. Use the search field to enter specific topics or channels. I'll start with a search for the term hiking. The top result is the hiking topic. Below, several channels are listed that contain stories on hiking. I'm going to follow the topic. Now let's do a search for a specific channel. I'm going to enter the Chicago Tribune, which is a major newspaper. It's available as a channel, but the vast majority of the stories are behind a subscription paywall. So if the Chicago Tribune is your local paper, $6 a month is probably pretty reasonable for all the content. But if you want to stick with only free content, it's probably not worth a follow because so few of the stories are available. At the bottom of the following column is a Discover Channels and Topics button. Tap and we're presented with a page of icons representing mostly channels and some topics. Just tap on each one to follow it. Tap Done and those that we tapped on will be listed under Channels and Topics. Tap the edit button here to rearrange the order of the topics and channels that you're following. I prefer to list my topics first and the channels below. If you've read newspapers for most of your life, it can be nice to arrange your topics sort of like newspaper sections, with maybe top stories first and then maybe local and world news, sports, business, etc. Then you can browse each topic one by one, much like going through a newspaper section by section. Notice that channels and topics will sync between our iCloud devices. 
So by utilizing channels and topics, we can get the news app set up to display exactly the information that we want to see on a daily basis.